So I finally received my Herba Mate tea and gourd, aka cup from Amazon. Long story, I ordered it, it got lost, I got a refund, and well, here we are. So here's the Herba Mate tea called Playa Dito, and then I'm pulling out the gourd, aka cup. Of course, I'm going to do an unboxing. Oh, okay, double boxed. Let's go. Uh, yeah, I like how the company, um, in case it's broken, they have plans for you to return it. That's really great. And then here I'm taking out the filter, a.k.a. Bombilla, and straw. Now I'm going to unbox the actual gourd, a.k.a. cup. And of course I got black. And you know, there are actually real gourds out there on Amazon, but it's super expensive. I'll put the link in the description to where I got the Herba Mate tea and this black and steel cup there you go got to turn it upside down because it's one-handed and there it looks really cool modern i like it nothing at the bottom okay let's go so here is the playa dito herba mate tea shout out to aleas he's the one who recommended for me straight from colombia or actually argentina and it's 500 grams and here it tells you all the nutrition and what i like is the best before date so the best before i believe is march 1st 2026 or january 3rd 2026 in any case then you get to see all the great nutrition that taking herba mate will give you okay so let's get ready so what I did was I boiled some hot water before and now I'm putting the rest of the hot water into my Yeti thermos. I also poured some of the hot water into the ceramic white teapot. I'm going to now put some cold water into the Yeti thermos that has hot water and the reason why is because as I drink the Herba Mate tea, I'll be able to pour that water in and drink more of it throughout the day. So here I am, I have the Playa Dito Urban Mate Tea. As you can see, there's the expiration date, and now I'm going to get ready to prepare the tea. So I'm taking the gourd, aka cup, and I'm going to be pouring one half to three quarters of the tea into the cup. And I'll explain later why that much. So here is the bombilla. One side was the filter, and the other is the straw. So the filter is for... Um, catching all the extra particles because you don't want to sip it up when you are enjoying your mate tea all right so um, i'm also going to have my water ready because once i put the tea leaves into the gourd aka cup i will be pouring some water all right so now it is time to open up the playa dito and here we go just got to get the scissors Thank God for time lapse. Okay, so we're pouring about, I'm going to do one half cup. And I thought it was one half cup. I missed the mark, so I ended up pouring a little bit more. Uh, I don't know if that's actually in the video. It depends. There's, you can see some of the dust, but don't worry. Um, that'll get all taken care of in the end. So there's uh, some of the, well, that's not really half a cup. So I'm going to end up pouring a little bit. See, I told you. Just a little bit more. So this is my first time, and I don't know how strong uh, the Herba Mate tea is going to taste, but like, well, we'll figure it out. Okay, now what they say is to create a, a little mountainito, like a little mountain. So you're supposed to like do exactly what I did and create like a little slope uh, inside your gourd or cup. And the reason for that is because you're actually going to be pouring the water at the base of the cup which i will do now very carefully i literally had to like oh there you go pour the water right at the base of the cup not all of it now you're still going to maintain that little mountainito and i'll explain later so now you take your bombilla and you take the filter part you put it right in and you kind of scoop it and get it all settled in there now, apparently, you're not supposed to move it. That's a no-no. Once it's there, just leave it. And then you can start to pour the rest of the water. The reason why you leave it is because you don't want to um, loosen up 
I guess, the, the, the leaves and stuff to get up into the straw. Now I poured some water, I'm just leveling it off, and that's it. It's time to drink. Apparently, you're supposed to let it steep for about one to two okay, minutes. Okay, guys, so And here it after goes. two minutes, you can My start very first literally sip of sipping the, Urban the Urban Mate, Mate tea, tea from Playa Dito. Shout out to Aleas. Okay, I needed to, didn't really quite come up. All right, not so bad. I mean, it's it tastes, it's leaves. There you go. Urban Mate tea. And I'm going to top it off a little bit with hot water. Hope you enjoy this video.